Hi folks, this is Max from GalaxyTabHacks.com um, So, I've got the, uh, um, I know some of you probably are having some lag issues with the new ICS update. Um, if you have the P7500 or P7510, you can now get the A1 kernel, uh, which works flawless. Per shoots kernel no longer works with your uh, the official ICS, please do not flash it. Um, I did it and it will break everything. Um, you can use A1 kernel and uh, even USB charging works with this, which is really cool. I got it connected to my computer here and uh, you'll see that is charging. So you get that without using any scripts, which is really cool. And if you want to overclock, just get Set CPU app. Um, you can get it on XDA. Just go Google it, sign up for XDA, it's free, and then download it um, and install the APK file. And uh, you can get it, I recommend uh, 1.4 and about 312 or 456 is fine. Put it on interactive, don't put it on performance. And uh, I see that it's a lot more smoother. Uh, my tap 10.1 is kind of you know, running as it should be. And we can run a quadrant real quick and uh, real quick here while we're at it. And by the way, if, if for those of you wondering about the uh, Note 10.1, I really love it. I actually have it right here. It's it's freaking awesome. It's freaking awesome. I've got uh, um, it, it's a total perfect upgrade to your Tab 10.1. I've got it on uh, 3G here. This one's the 3G version. I also got the Wi-Fi version. It's freaking awesome. Um, you know what? This thing is super fast. It's got the fastest processor in the world. 1.4 gigahertz. Xenos uh, Samsung processor, which is rated higher than um, Tegra 3 processor, and with all this TouchWiz bloatware, it runs pretty darn fast. And a lot of reviewers say there's a lot of lag. There's absolutely no lag on this whatsoever. Um, as you can see, it's really fast. Anyway, I just want to give you a little, little teaser there. If you get a Note 10.1, I'm also developing ROMs for that one, so. Um, um, you can install high on Android ROM, and also I might make one for uh, Galaxy Tab 10.1 soon um, when I have some time. But this kernel is awesome because it gives you um, overclocked GPU. Also, it gives you from 333 megahertz. It's overclocked it to 400 megahertz. I'm definitely needed on this Tab 10.1 if you're going to run official ICS and uh, 2830. Not too bad. Um, don't worry about the scores too much. Go ahead and install it. You'll notice the difference. It's much, much faster. All that lag is gone. Um, so if you've updated to the latest ICS on your Wi-Fi version or the 3, 3G version, um, go ahead and install this. Um, this is the extreme version. So you can go 1.4 gigahertz. Y you can go, uh, I think, 1.2 also. There you go. But I recommend 1.4. It should work for most of you. It should be fine. Um, no problems whatsoever uh, with the USB charging and also there's Voodoo sound and uh, um, which means I think you can download the Voodoo app from the market. Well let me try it real quick. There you go. You can uh, download the Voodoo sound which allows you to kind of um, mess with the sound with your uh, headphones with the speakers, make it louder, whatever. Um, so great kernel. Love it. Uh, probably the best kernel right now. Do not flash on any custom kernels. This is only for ICS, official ICS, um, but definitely makes your TAP 10.1 into what it should be. Um, so go ahead and flash it if you haven't uh, flashed it. And I'm going to start, um, I'm going to flash some new ROMs too, and I'll have uh, uh, updates on that. I mean, if you have a Galaxy TAP 10.1, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxytabhex.com. We update you once a week with ROM of the Week, tips, hacks, and more, and also it's a great way for you to get in contact with me. And please add me to your Google+, Facebook, or Twitter. Um, and as always, stay high on Android, yo. Yeah, see y'all later.